everyone and welcome to my channel. Thank you very much for clicking on my video. So for today we're going to go over one of the things that I kind of blew up on because uh, I went to MOF, MOFT's website and I purchased some of their, I purchased a MagSafe wallet from them and also the adhesive one, the one that goes in the back of your phone. As I was going through their site, I actually saw a couple of things that I thought, hey, you know what? Some of these things would be perfect for my audience. I went on a little bit of a shopping spree. Uh, the one that we're gonna go over today is gonna be this one here, this little baby right there. This has actually adhesive uh, that's removable, right? You could be able to go ahead and peel it on off however you wanna use it. Uh, I'm more of the type that once I put it on there, that's because I'm going to go ahead and leave it on there for a while. I don't like to go ahead and be taking things on and off because it, it, if you do a lot of that on and off thing, it's going to go ahead and you're going to reduce the strength on it dramatically. So, um, so what this one is going to do is actually going to raise the back of your laptop at least 10 degrees. This is going to actually go ahead and lift it up a little bit. So if it lifts it up, your palm is going to go ahead and rest on your laptop and then you could be able to type this way. And supposedly, because it does that little 10%, it's supposed to kind of help you, right? Relieve some of that pressure that you're putting on the nerve that you have on your wrist. And so to me, do I have sometimes, you know, pain in my wrist? Yes, I do. I'm on my computer all day when I'm working and things like that. So, but you gotta look at it this way too. On keyboards, when you're in front of a computer, a desktop computer, it has the little lifts on the back so you can be able to go ahead and lift up that keyboard. On a laptop, you don't have that. Right? You don't have that either on a laptop, Chromebook, you don't have that access. So this is supposed to help with that. And so now if you put this on there, you should be able to go ahead and lift it up. Now, the good thing about this is that it's nice and flat up against the laptop or Chromebook, right? Enough talking, let's go ahead and get into it and let's go ahead and see what it could do. See you guys in a bit. Okay, so here we have the Moth Ultralight Foldable Adhesive Stand. Uh, it fits a 11 to 17 inch, holds up to 18 pounds. Uh, so let's go ahead and open this up. Okay, it's a bit of a challenge. Ah, they want to make it hard. <laughs> All right, let me uh, open this baby up. All right, you see, there's nothing else in there. So it's so all in this little package that just came out. You have your little welcome. All right, thank you. All right, and you can see how thin this is. Uh, it does have a uh, protective layer, of course, over and over the adhesive on the back of it. Uh, but let's go ahead and put it on our laptop here, or Chromebook, <laughs> which is what I'm using here. So let's go ahead and apply it. Let's see how it's going to go. Let's take this little film off the adhesive. Now, this adhesive, uh, you should be able to take it on and off as much as you want. But me, it's going to stay on there. So I'm trying to get a good fit on it. All right, let's make sure it goes all the way to the edge. Press down on it. Solid. Now look at it. This is really thin going up against your laptop. You could see it from here, this nice little angle. And then once you're ready, you could open it up, give you that 10 degrees, nice little lift right at the back. So this way then it does incline the keyboard on the laptop for you. You could be able to go ahead and put your palms right on the resting place on your laptop and go ahead and type away. Your hands are not going to be straight. It's going to have that little bend to it. So it's going to help with any kind of pain that you might have on your wrist. But let me go ahead and show you. So this is the table. It's going to go ahead and bend this. And that's where you get your 10 degrees. So you can see the angle that you're going to be able to get that. And basically what you're going to do is with your fingers, you're going to go ahead and just push it out just like this. Go ahead and put it on your table and bam now you could be able to go ahead and type with an incline of 10 degrees on your keyboard this is something that's going to help people out with uh problems with the wrist and problem with typing when it's uh too low but that's it fold it down put it in your bag and you're out the door now there is two things that worries me about this thing and number one is if you notice the vent area is kind of closed up you only have opening on both ends but in the middle, it's sealed. So that worries me. But I'll keep an eye on it. See if it warms up too much. And this way then I'll just take this part off or cut it off. And we should be good to go. Now the second thing, it doesn't matter to me too much because I don't use it this way at all. But if you use it as a tablet, you're going to have a gap. Yes, the thing is very thin and invisible basically. But when you go ahead and turn this into a tablet, you're going to have that gap right there. Is it going to bother you? 
completely up to you. But those are the two things, the tablet mode and the vent. Those are the things that would bother me. But this product has gotten good reviews. There's been people that have used this and they've had no issues with it whatsoever. Placing it on the laptop, Chromebook, their Macs, it's working fine. So for me, those are just my worries, but it might not be a big deal for some. So I consider this maybe anywhere between a three and a four star product. Um, I like the fact that it raises up, it inclines for you for people that have wrist issues. But to me, the covering of the vents is a big issue for me. <laughs> so I just want to point that out. I wanted to show you guys. That way you guys could have an idea of what this does. And you guys can make the decision if you want to go ahead and purchase this for your own uh, use or not. But now you're aware of what it offers. So this one here that I have is a 10 degrees for $19.99. They do offer a second one for 25 degrees, which is a little bit higher. Also for the same price, $19.99. But there you guys have it. Let me know what you guys think. Put some comments. Hit like on the video. Subscribe if you haven't. And also stay tuned because we have some more Moth products that we're going to go ahead and review. Thank you very much, guys. Take care of yourselves and each other. Be safe. Peace out. Adios.